back, back to, to our, our channel. channel. My name is Lucia. My name is Lorena. And, and we, we are, are the Leon Duo. Duo. So today we're going to be eating shrimp, oh, like a, craw a crawfish technically. Um, so we got this at, it's called Crawfish Company in Somar. Um, I think it's pretty good. It sometimes has a hit and miss, t to be honest. Um, the first time I tried it, it tasted like dirty fish water. Yeah, but I mean... I don't want to drive all the way to where we, where we normally go, which is Kicking Cajun. That one is really good, but right now I don't feel like driving, so this is like our quick, quick crawfish type of thing. So it is crawfish company. We got three pounds of crawfish, or shrimp, sausage, and corn, and then we got some Cajun fries Side and some, some white fries. rice. So we are recording outside, so if it's a little windy yeah. or so. Um, also, if you hear our nieces talk, too. they're also sitting next to us because we're sharing the three pounds. Okay, so let's get to it. I like to dip, put the garlic part on my rice. So I got my mom's big spoon. I'm about to scoop this up. So, how's everyone doing with this whole coronavirus? We were supposed to go to Hawaii and we had to cancel because of the virus. I was so sad about it. I know it sucks because we didn't even get to celebrate our birthday properly and now Hawaii. So, this year isn't the year. Starting off bad. And we're barely in May. Well, gonna be May. Mm -hmm. By the way, we have our Coke. So, yeah. They had... I mean, technically, we could have still gone to Hawaii, but, like, um... Everything technically where we're just supposed to be in a room, still quarantined, doing nothing, <laughs> just in Hawaii. Um, but like I would, like yeah, I would have, I would have gone. <laughs> Sorry. I wouldn't mind of going, but yeah, like I didn't want to not do anything. I wanted to swim, swim with sharks. I wanted to go swimming with dolphins. See, um, snorkeling. So, by the way, you're gonna try to get the chunky stuff on the shrimp. That's the best. Yeah, I was really excited to go swimming with dolphins. That's like the only thing I care to do. I want to go swim with sharks. And I like, I like to learn stuff about history. So I wanted to go to Pearl Harbor. That oh, was yeah. our first thing that we were gonna do. And I'm bummed. I'm very sad. It's just been bad. And then I had EDC tickets. EDC got postponed to October. I can't make it in October. So I had to cancel that. Sorry, guys. Where did my shrimp go? Did you take it? Mm -mm. She took my shrimp. Oh, maybe it had no head. That's why you took it. <laughs> oh, by the way, I don't suck on the heads. My dad likes the heads, but I, I do. I, the The feeling of just eyeballs don't go. Don't. I don't like it. I don't like when I don't like to bite them like people do. I usually just suck on the juice. Yeah, or whatever's on top. But some people bite them and I'm like, mm, no. I don't know why we decided to eat outside. There's flies. Summer, y'all. Summer. The flies come out. But I mean, it's, it's fresh. The corn. I want to try making, um, this myself. I've seen a lot of recipes. I want to try 
B loves um, thing that she has, the dipping thing that she has. I really, really want to try that. I was seeing that she has different flavors. She has like the mild, spicy, and like, I don't know what else. But. Mm. I've always seen when people make it and they eat it with the shrimp. Oh my God. The way she eats it too. God. Se me antoja. I don't know what we mentioned, but this comes with sausages as well. So the coronavirus, our best friend, you know? <laughs> the one that doesn't want to leave. <laughs> that best friend that you just can't get rid of, right? So... I hope everybody is safe, and I hope everybody is doing good. Every family member, if they got it, if they're in the hospital, I hope they get well. Because I can't imagine not being close to my mom or my dad because they got it. Mm. And thankfully, we have our jobs still, but a lot of people sadly lost their jobs. Yeah. Um, that to me is like support your local... Your local businesses, like your people, the ones you see, like the, the people smaller hustling. businesses, and stuff. yeah, like donut shops, like flower shops, anything like that. Small businesses, you know, like Carl Jr., McDonald's, and all that. That's not gonna go out of business, to be honest. Let's be real, like that's not gonna go out of business at the end. Yeah, you need technically like the whole world to stop buying it so it could go out of business. They're millionaire companies. Mm -hmm. Like, we need to help support the more local ones. Like, paleteros, like, mm. the people that sell fruit, anybody, you know? Like, right I, now people are selling masks. I bought one. I bought some to support them. Even, like, I have my own, so I probably won't wear the one I bought, but I still bought it to support them. Because what if they were, I they lost their mask. job? Their ice cream mans. You don't see a lot of them going out right now. They're trying to hustle. They're trying to make money. their money somehow. Like, they have a family to feed. I'm pretty sure they need to feed themselves. Like, There's some people that are, like, where they rent that they have already been kicked out because they can't afford the rent anymore. And it's sad because it's like, how could you blame somebody for not having the money when you can't even get money from the company that you work? You get me? Like... It's like, what? It's a very messed up situation we're in right now. Like that video going around. I wasn't going to bring it up because I didn't want to get mad. But the video about the guys um, throwing an egg. Uh huh. The video about the guys throwing an egg um, at the guy selling masks. Oh, no. Sorry, guys. Our neighbor's outside and, like, they water everybody. <laughs> but we'll talk about that later. Mm -hmm. What? What were you saying? Yeah, like, I hate seeing things like that, especially, like, on Facebook, whatever, videos like that. Yeah, like, it why are you gonna... me off so bad. I'll be in jail by now. Like, why? What gets you to the right mind that, okay, throw an egg at somebody because they're hustling or like, how for they a did? Joke. Like, even for like, I don't know if you guys seen like paleteros that like people take their money and jack their stuff. It's like, what do you get? Like, you posting it, uh, you just get flashback. To be honest, because uh, we stand up for our culture and we stand up for people that hustle. Like. You're not just gonna, just because you think it's funny, you think it's a joke that you can mess with people's business or like. Like they're just trying to make money one way or another. Yeah. And that really, really, really boiled my blood. I hope they catch them. I hope they go to jail. Sadly, I hope they get beat up in jail. I'm sorry. That's, I'm telling you my truth opinion. Karma's a I hope it gets you.
She tells me not to cuss, but I do what I want. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but it's like, I don't know. I don't understand those type of people. Like, how do you live with yourself knowing that you're hurting somebody? Like, in that case, the world is never going to be good because it's like, You'll rather see somebody being down than picking them up, and it's like, what the hell? Okay, let's get off this topic because we're gonna start getting mad. Oh, our friend, shout out to you, Jennifer. Hey, she bought us um, the black spicy noodles, the spicy noodles. She's chickening out and she's not gonna try it. I don't think she's gonna try it. So I think I'm gonna try it, but I think I'm gonna I'm still gonna fail. Well yeah, I'm pretty sure I am too. We failed at the other one. Bad. But I'm probably gonna have my husband in it. Cause he like I said, like with shrimp, he gets the spices one. With wings, he gets like the not like the blazing or nothing, he just gets like the mango habanero. But I feel like he can handle his um spice. So I think I'm going to have them um, in the video as well. I'm doing the challenge. We want to do the challenge also of the the nasty sodas. Oh, yeah. Like the ranch, um, the wings, the buffalo wings, buffalo, the grass. grass. I don't know, but there's cat litter. Oh, I'm not But I ain't one. about that. <laughs> I ain't that dirty. <laughs> yeah. Like, like we've done the bamboozle one. Obviously, we weren't making videos at that time, but we just did it like as a family ourselves. And the grass one wasn't that bad at that time. It just it tastes like how you would think it would. But there's taste. a lot of YouTubers that even the drink doesn't taste that bad. Like it doesn't. I don't think it, it doesn't would. taste that bad. But like the rotten egg and the dog food, hell no. Is that it just one, me that can. That of... one made me cry. Oh yeah, the the dog food one. I almost gagged. I. I couldn't hold that one down. No, but is it just me or like I can get a taste more? by the smell? Like it tastes the way it smells. It's weird. But yeah. Sorry, give me more shrimp to my knees. Are you not going to eat the sausage? I like the sausage. I like that wiener. This one and the other one. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, I know we're like deep in. Yes, we are. We are eating with our fingers. My bills like cringe as people that eat it with gloves. Okay, I eat it with gloves, but when I have fake nails, if you guys have ever had fake nails and food mm -hmm. gets stuck in the bottom, it's the worst thing ever, especially trying to take it out. So mm -hmm. that's the only time I use gloves. But other than that, and me too, even like, because uh -uh. sometimes the, the shrimp sauce gets stuck to your nails as well. But the like, time we went <laughs> to shrimp place, she got some what is it like botched um ombre nails from white to like pink they were ugly okay but we went <laughs> are you mad because you can't can. i'm gonna bleep it out okay so we went to eat um kick and cajun she didn't buy gloves i told her like you know you have acrylic nails it's white maybe you should get some gloves she I didn't, didn't. Care. by the time we were out of there her nails were yellow my nails were already messed up i didn't really care for them anymore yeah but it turned yellow. I but like, no, it was just that moment because then once I washed them again, they turned not back to white. I don't know, but just that's the only time I wear gloves. I when my mom makes shrimp or anything like that, we're just used to eating it with our hands. When we go eat like at the actual restaurant, like Kicking Cajun, um, people stare at us. Like it was dirty they stare at us like, what the hell? Like, why are you eating with your hands? And it's like, why are you eating with gloves? Like they legit, oh, they, like, suck on it? they legit suck on the glove. And the glove is still like, like, what? <laughs> what do you mean? I mean, all you have to do is wash your hands, literally. But I don't know. I hate when people stare. And I'm the type of person like if I'm eating and like when people stare at me, I'm like, 
I don't say it out loud. I'm like, these people are staring at me and it's pissing me off. Whoopsie. These people are staring at me and it's pissing me off. And then my husband's like, stop, stop. But I'm like, mind your own damn business. I'm eating, you're eating, have fun. But, but, uh, I love shrimp. I wish I could, we could, maybe next time we'll add like lobster tails, like the king crabs and stuff. Ooh. Our friend Jennifer wanted to do it with us. Jennifer, take a little nibble, Jennifer. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> We're going to have her in a video. If anything, we'll buy the one with the lobster and we'll have her in the we'll video. Her. Or she said, she did say she made this herself. Yeah. So we'll just buy the stuff, make it, and then just have her. We should probably order like the beloved sauce. Mm. But it didn't really look good. Because she wants it too. Mm -mm. The way they do it, the chunks and stuff. Oh. So she wants to try it too so that would be a good video we'll ask her and see if she wants to be in a video um she does bomb ass makeup yeah guys she does like really good makeup i tell her to make a youtube channel as well i told her i could be her doll but she's not really motivated yet don't say that no she doesn't she's not uh. she's at it but hopefully she gets there because girl homegirl's going to school yeah. Good for her. Props for her. Hustle that. Get that degree, girl. Get that paycheck. Because mm. girl already want to drop out. <laughs> no, but yeah. Sorry, but I didn't. Hopefully, oh, yes, because like she does really bad makeup. Mm -hmm. So, hopefully she does. And we'll, we'll link her page down below. She does really good makeup. Yeah, like her Instagram and stuff. She does really she does nice makeup. Maybe when this is all over and there's like parties or prom, and there's still gonna be prom um, for your makeup and stuff. One thing I cannot wait for when this is all over is to go through my eyebrows. <laughs> I don't have that dark eyebrows, but they're heavy. I'm a caterpillar right now. I have two caterpillars on my eyebrows. I miss it so bad. And my toes, actually. I miss my pedicures. I just want to go out. I miss the beach. Like, Oh, yeah. I love to go to the beach at night because, I mean, one, there's nobody. It's just so peaceful. Yeah, like, you just hear the waves. Like, you see all the stars and... It's just really, really nice. I just miss eating at places too. Like buying something, let's say just breakfast, I hop or whatever. It doesn't taste the same. And you eat it there. Like, it, yeah, when you bring it home, it's not the same. I mean, I personally don't like eating at restaurants. Like, I'd rather eat at home. I do. But. I like for people to judge me. <laughs> no, yeah. I know, I do. I do miss eating there. Because then, like this, you get in a bag, you bring it to the car. It's hot as balls right now. So, obviously, you're going to have your air blasting. It's going to make the food cold by the time you get here. Take it out. This is not the same. No, but I can't wait to at least go do something fun. Go to a beach. Go to a club. Yeah. Go to Vegas. I know. I miss my sister. She lives in Vegas. Shout out to you, Sylvia. <laughs> but, yeah. I just want to go out. Like, we're so attached to family that even my sister that lives here, like, all my sisters that live here, it's like, they can't even visit us. <laughs> it's a sad time. Guy, you have a nephew? He's like six months. No. He's like eight months old. Mm -hmm. Eight months. Yeah. He's eight months old. Oh my god. He's almost a year. Oh. He has two little teeth coming out. The teeth that come out first. Oh my god. He found that he has a weenie. <laughs> that is not pleasant. Let me so every time we change his diaper, he tries to reach for it. 
mind you, we've never <laughs> had a boy in our family, okay? It's always been like girls. we have a boy, but not raised. Like, like we, we didn't, didn't raise them ourselves. Boy. Like change them at birth and stuff. So we've always had girls. We've always always um had girls. So this is like the first boy that we've actually had since newborn, and we've like changed and stuff. So at first it was like, oh my god, like how do I do this? I don't want him to pee on me or nothing. So it was like whatever. But then now he knows he has it, and he always tries to reach for it. I'm like, you need to stop, boy. I'm like, mm mm mm. He loves Mickey Mouse. Oh, he does. <laughs> I can't wait. Hopefully, this is all over so we can throw him a birthday party. Guys, I bought a computer. I feel like we're talking a lot. One of my dream computers. So, hopefully, our videos get a good upgrade because we need it <laughs> my mom came out now saben igual las papas no she doesn't like this place she goes mm -mm. <laughs> She doesn't know what we're doing, so she has my sister. <laughs> oh, she's funny. Oh, maybe we shouldn't say this. What if she's getting a tattoo? Oh yeah. Why shouldn't I say that? Because people think we still want the Rona. <laughs> oh yeah. What I, I got? It's clean. She's covering it. She'll be good. It's funny because, like, okay, so of course, to do to get a tattoo, you need to have your research on people, of course, right? So, I wanted to see what people Super technically Mina. their connects, right? Just, just so I could see their profile, how they work, what type are they more into, like, some co work really nice on portraits and everything else, but once it comes down to animals. They don't look like animals. <laughs> so I went on Facebook and I'm like, hey, oh, it's a page where like you could sell, you could post all these other things. Um, and I post, I commented like, oh, does anybody know? The magic. Like, room. does anybody know <laughs> their like good tattoo places or tattoo artists in general or like whatever? And all these people started coming for me, like, oh my god, like, how could you get, um, do you, you want, do you want coronavirus, or do you want, like, you really want an open wound right do you now? Want, they're like, do you want coronavirus, or do you want, like, a tattoo, and I was like, I was like, I was like, first of all, I was like, if you don't know a place, don't comment, and not just that, but it's like, once again, like I said, you need to get your proof, your people, who works good? Who doesn't? You don't just go to anyone. You don't just go like, oh, the shop is open. Let me go yeah. in there. Like little you know? things like words and stuff like that. Little designs. Cool. Go for it. Like, I'm pretty sure I'll do it too. But the piece she wants, it's a, it's a lion. It's a big piece. Obviously, if you're going to be getting a big piece, something that's going to be on your body forever yeah. that like, big. I'm not just going to go to like a random ass dude. Yeah. Like you do, do need to do your research. You need to see how their animals come out stuff like that yeah so. but like it just bugged me because it's like but it's, people were like, like sorry you want the rona <laughs> like sorry you like some people that were commenting also had a tattoos and i'm like um sorry i didn't get a mess up tattoo <laughs> like that's not my fault um but i don't want to mess up that too like like she said my pit my piece is gonna be big and it's gonna be technically half like half a sleeve in a way so it's like of course i want somebody good but yes i did find somebody good and hopefully he doesn't fail me um but yeah like hopefully everything goes good and everything is gonna come out good so wish me luck guys <laughs> i still don't have any i was gonna get one in hawaii which 
was we were leaving in May 3rd. I think that's a Tuesday. We're leaving on Tuesday. We were leaving on May 5th. Oh, yeah, May 5th. Yeah, because Cinco de Mayo. I forgot. We were leaving on May 5th, and I already had convinced my parents. My parents are like, they don't like them. My dad doesn't care. But uh, we had convinced her. I convinced them because I was like, they all have one. How come I can't get one? But I was already going to get one in Hawaii, and I was so excited for it. And then, not no more. I mean, I'm still going to go to Hawaii. Once this is all over, I'm rebooking that thing right away. And I'm going with or without them. Her and my other sister were going, and I'm me and going. my husband. I've been wanting to go. I never cared. Sad to say, but yes, I never did care. Um, but in a way, we did see like, oh, our health is more important. Other people are more important that we're putting their health in, into like the same situation. So it's like, then that's when we decided to cancel everything. Um, but yeah, they did give us like, oh, if you want to rebook in a future notice or like later on. So hopefully, yeah. So I want to book. Okay, guys. So. We're, We're full. full. <laughs> I guess all the talking filled our stomach with air, yeah. soda, corn, sausage, shrimp, rice, <laughs> fries. <laughs> a lot of food. But um, yeah, we're full. We only left like four or five shrimps. So not that be bad. Be nice to people. Support your local businesses. Oh, yeah. Be nice to people. Because be nice. we're going downhill, guys. If I see another video like that. <laughs> Yeah, Especially like, against my people. I don't understand those people, to be mm. honest. That's the, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> but, no, no. Okay, guys. Oh, and she made a new intro. I'm excited. Maybe that'll be in the one for the, the It's going to be this one. No, it's going to be in this one. So. Oh, hopefully. That'll be, you already saw it then. <laughs> oh, hopefully you like the new intro. Let us know down below. Um. If you guys maybe have any recommendations. I don't know why the comments are disabled. We tried disabling software. them. We tried disabling them like so many times. And it works. But then it disables again like three minutes later. So we don't know what's wrong with it. But hopefully you guys could comment on the old videos. Or this video could finally show the comments. Yeah. Or if the comments don't come out. Feel free to message us on like on Instagram. Yeah, like show us what type of other ideas you want, like or give us feedback on how you like the video. Did we talk we too can, much? Did, what we can improve? <laughs> anything? What? Yeah. Oh, cause I'm a chatterbox. Hell yeah, I am. If you give me a chance to talk, I'll talk. Give me a topic. Mm, done. Okay. Well, guys. Bye.